that Gate One has put together a really good itinerary, giving you a sense of the South and a, a heritage that influences a lot of things in our country. So we're seeing parts of the South you study in school, and we're seeing the land that you've heard about, the Spanish moss, the plantations. It's a real treat to kind of immerse yourself in the Deep South. I love history and bringing it alive. I feel like on this itinerary, Historical South, we're pulling threads of history through the whole itinerary, and it's fun to be the one helping tie it all together. This Gate One tour of the Historical South begins in colorful St. Augustine, the oldest city in the United States. We then head north, visiting Jekyll Island's historic district, before reaching Savannah, Georgia, the hostess city of the South, teeming with age-old squares for strolling. Next, we stop off in the beautifully preserved city of Beaufort, South Carolina, on our way to Charleston, a city brimming with historical charm and culinary delights. This tour takes you inside the fascinating history and gorgeous natural beauty of the historic South. Welcome, Gate One travelers, to St. Augustine, Florida. In St. Augustine, we explore the rich Spanish colonial history. One of the favorite attractions is the Castillo de San Marcos, the oldest masonry fort in the United States. We have a chance to walk through the old city gates of St. Augustine and exploring St. George Street, full of colorful shops, eateries, and music. I've thoroughly enjoyed what we've seen so far. I've never been in this area before. The history is just incredible, from the Revolutionary War to the Civil War and to the present times, and it's really impressive. In Jekyll Island, we visit the National Historic District, where we learn the fascinating history of this millionaire's club. The rich from the Northeast would come here in the winter and bring their families. We also have the opportunity to dine in the Jekyll Island's Club Hotel dining room, where, when the millionaire members met there for meals, one-sixth of the world's wealth was in that very room. Hey y'all, this is Big Mama in Savannah, Georgia. Just want to invite all of our friends at Gate One to come and take a trolley ride with Old Town Trolleys. Our stay in Savannah starts with a wonderful trolley tour. We go around the entire perimeter of the city and we move inside among the gorgeous squares. There are 22 in all in Savannah. When I was here 20 years ago, it was not restored like this. And to see it restored is a whole new experience. We stop off in beautiful Beaufort, South Carolina, the second oldest city in the state. And this is a place where you want to sit back and immerse yourself in the easygoing lifestyle there. It has an amazing array of antebellum architecture and you get to see it on a horse-drawn carriage tour with a wonderful local guide. And you're going to hear some great stories of all the famous movies filmed here. Charleston was founded back in 1670. There are pre-revolutionary buildings, antebellum homes that are still lived in today. And as far as touring here, there's such a large concentration of things you can see easily by foot in the city. We get an overview of it on the bus and then you have some free time to go back and see things at your leisure. In Charleston, an expert local guide takes us on a city tour. We end the tour at City Market Charleston. The ladies weave in the sweet grass baskets. This is the only area in the world outside of Angola, Africa, where you'll find that particular weave. The art was brought over with the slaves and passed down from mother to child through the years. And so it's really a piece of history as well as a souvenir. Oh, oh, oh kumbaya, kumbaya, gala for a come by here. Welcome to Boone Hall Plantation. Boone Plantation reminds me of the things that I learned in school that now have a meaning. You can get a true appreciation of what this country has gone through and so have its people. The performer was marvelous. Beautiful voice, beautiful explanations, and truly a remarkable woman. <laughs> Kumbaya. Kumbaya for real. <laughs> this is my first time with Gate One. I'm impressed with the type of hotel that we have been staying at. They're very nice, clean, elegant hotels. Well, the food has been one of the highlights. Uh, this southern cooking is delicious. 
My guests love to use their evenings to explore the bountiful seafood of the region, from the low country shrimp, to the fresh oysters, to the flounder coming in from the day's catch. And I think the most important highlight is Mary, our guide. She has been a wonderful guide, so sensitive, so welcoming. I was just so impressed, the quality of the hotels, the quality of the tour guides. This is our first time, but certainly not our last. Gate One has been marvelous. Well, we have a wonderful group. The other people you get to know, they're from all over the country, all different backgrounds. When people were going around saying, and this is my first Gate One trip, and this is my first Gate One trip, in my mind I kept thinking, oh, you're going to be so pleased. <laughs> you are really going to love this. I invite you to come on down and join us on Gate One's Historical South Shore. Hope to see you soon. Yeah!